Hello, my wonderful people. It's happening. 2023. How I and Femi Falana helped to be emerged as Labour Party presidential candidate. Omo Elishowere reveals. Hello, my wonderful people. If you've been paying attention, you'll know that Omo Elishowere probably did not think, imagine, or thought about that Peter Obi will become as big as he is. And so probably he's, he feels that he's not been given as much prominence as he should or recognition like he should. And so you can tell that really sincerely speaking, he may not truly really be happy because um, he has antagonized Peter Obi repeatedly. Yes, he has also gone ahead to say that um, Peter Obi Peter Obiu um, is like one of them. He's deceiving Nigerians. But you're telling us now that you helped him emerge as a presidential candidate. So why are you trying to help him? Why are you trying to destroy him now if he has finally emerged as the presidential candidate? So these are some of the things we are looking at. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. Let's get all the details. 2023. How I and Femi Falana helped Peter Obi emerge as Labour Party presidential candidate, Omoyele Showare reveals. According to a report by The Punch, the presidential candidate of the African Action Congress, AAC, and human rights activist, Omoyele Showare, has come out to allege that he was instrumental to Peter Obi emergence as the Labour Party flag bearer ahead of the 2023 general election. While speaking at the Goni Farua Memorial Lecture in Lagos on Monday, Showare stated that the Labour Party did not have smooth sail in his attempt to name Peter Obi as his presidential flag bearer, adding that several calls were made for the former Anambra state governor not to be given the party's presidential ticket. Going further, the activist disclosed that it took a collaboration, legal effort between himself and senior advocate of Nigeria, Femi Falana, to en ensure that the Labour Party presented the preferred candidate, Peter Ubi. The Labour Party ran into a problem. There was a member of the Labour Party who insisted that the Labour Party could not, could not present the candidate of Peter Ubi they had a legal problem. They went on and obtained a judgment in court from the court appeal and handed it over to Falana, who used and defend the, defend the Labour Party and by extension, Peter Obi candidacy. Yes, I am just telling you that we are in the business of saving people. Moele Showare alleged. And today, it feels like we have no part in it and it's following the other people who did nothing for his emergence, who did not stand with him, and who have not given him all that he needed to be who he needs to be. And this is why, Nigerians, we need to look at it very critically. If you listen to that, how does it sound to you? Is it a man desperate for recognition because uh, Peter Obi is gaining, for instance, all the recognition, and he could be, he feels maybe he's, been forgotten could that be could that be could it be or could it be a genuine concern that he has been forgotten himself and fallen effort to ensure that peter will be get to where he is today long and short of it peter will be has forgotten the hands that fed him the party had problem him and uh, fallen came into the picture honestly speaking i've not heard this part so it's interesting to know that of course, now person go to the help person. But at the same time, we should be careful not to become jealous of people's success. We should be, I'm not saying he's jealous. Don't get it wrong. Don't get it wrong at all. I'm just putting it out there that we should be careful. Because in life, you may be a ladder to somebody else's greatness. I may be one. And the truth is that if you're, an, if you're a ladder, meaning that the thing, it, 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 it goes above you. Yes, so we should be careful not to feel that we hold the key to always control and hold the very person or the thing into a particular position forever and ever. Okay, life happens. Yes, 
Some people will not appreciate what you've done for them. Despite the fact that you give them a hand and a leg, they may not. Some people will forever be grateful, acknowledge and be thankful. Some That's life for you. Some others may not, for, may not remember you. But the truth is, whichever line of the divide you come to find yourself, don't feel that your reward is going to come from any man you've helped. And if they fail to acknowledge you, don't worry, you've done a good thing. Your hands will stand, your imprint will be felt in the sand of time. It will never be forgotten. I can assure you, it may look like it has been forgotten, but trust me, it can never be forgotten. Your imprint in the sand of time, they may not even acknowledge they may not even want to recognize. They may even say the story and totally forget about you. This is me just trying to make a more elite where I feel that it does not all begin and depend and end with him. Yes, probably he has sincerely, truly, okay, supported this young, this young man, Peter Obi. Okay, probably, sincerely, the help has come. But it feels like Peter Obi is not uh, recognizing, acknowledging, okay, all that needs to be. However, truth must become the essence of the days. Okay? Truth must become the essence and we must take it rather very seriously. Okay? We must take it very, very seriously. Whatever Peter Obi stands for, whatever we, we, we've come to be, we must ensure that at the end of the day, every one of us, okay, we do that which is absolutely right and necessary. Okay? We do that which is absolutely right and necessary to move Nigeria forward. The most important thing, is the country what are we doing to effect change what are we doing to ensure that at the end of the day we have a true leader who is honestly and sincerely concerned about this nation what are we doing what are we putting in place okay so these are some of the things that we must pay attention to and never in any way form or kind neglect the fact that you and i have a duty you and i have a role to play okay and in all, in all of this, there must be something that we must do, that we must put in place to know that at the end of the day, every one of us must present and must ensure that we do that which is right. Okay? Remember you have a voice. Remember you have a voice. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Like us. Share. Subscribe. Click on the notification button. God bless. Have a lovely day. And a fantastic day. Whatever happened, we are in this together to make Nigeria work again.